As a Jesuit school, we hold true to a, a few really important ideas and maxims in educating young men. The first, which is common to most Jesuit schools, but I think especially prevalent at PrEP, is this idea of cura personalis, which is a Latin phrase that roughly translates to care for each individual student, or even extending further, care for the student as an individual. Our teachers at Georgetown Prep, they know our students, and they know our students as more than a name on a roster, as more than a number in a grade book. They know what their skills are, they know what their weaknesses are. They know what their dreams are, what their objectives are, they know why they're at PrEP, and they know why they love PrEP, and they know what, what they struggle with at PrEP, and they know where they're confident and where they're not confident. Our teachers know how to help them, and our teachers create the structure and the teacher-student relationship that makes it possible to give the maximum amount of support to our students. It's certainly not unique to Georgetown Prep that we want our students to succeed, but here at Prep we have made intentional decisions to ensure that we are structured for that success to exist. Our teachers teach an average class load of four classes. Our average class size is 16 students. That makes it a foregone conclusion that our teachers are giving a vast amount of time to their students in support of their academic goals. We have created the conditions here at PrEP to make Cora Personalis a, a, a huge part of our academic program. Um, and I think that teacher-student relationship is one of the things that really makes PrEP stand out. Academically, openness to growth is a hallmark of our academic program. We want every student at PrEP to be challenged without being overwhelmed and we know that our students are ready for that challenge. We hold our students to high expectations. We do that because holding our students to high expectations and pushing them towards areas in which they might have to find comfort in their discomfort, that's what's going to enable them to grow. If we allow them to coast for four years, they're never going to grow to the best versions of themselves that they can be. One of the things that I personally often encourage our students to think about is that they don't need to be the best, but they need to be their best at Georgetown Prep. And we are constantly pushing our students to know what it means to be the best version of themselves academically. That openness to growth comes from the level of challenge and the level of rigor that we put on our students' plates. By striving for excellence in everything that they do and by, by being open to the growth that our academic curriculum offers, uh, we believe that we are constantly challenging our students to be their best selves.